If you're a business owner, especially in the US, you know that the economy is not so good right now. Hiring freezes are rampant and there's more uncertainty than ever before. I've worked and talked to my clients, including Hollywood producers, Fortune 500 agencies, and also seven-figure marketing agencies. And they all share the same sentiment. Hiring in the US is about to change and it's about to change permanently. Here's everything you need to know. Despite the economy, the smart business owners are staying afloat, even thriving in this economy. How? By being smart on how and where they hire their employees. In 2024, if you're a US business, it's stupid not to hire overseas talent. At least outsource some parts of your operations to developing countries. They're 70% cheaper, provide the same quality of work if not better, and they'll be some of the best employees that you've ever had if you know how to hire them correctly. So what positions should you outsource first? Here are the positions on your screen. Now for these positions, you can easily find expert remote talent abroad to do the job for you better at 30% of the cost. So you can hire from regions like the Philippines, Colombia, Mexico, South Africa, even Indonesia. Outsource these roles to these regions and watch how your profitability will soar up and you will be immune to any recessions even in the future. Point number two is long gone are the days of hiring employees based on just their CVs, portfolio, or their past work or resumes. You can't be fooled by CVs and portfolios because people are getting desperate. They'll lie on their CV, they'll lie on their resume, they'll lie in their portfolio because it's tough for businesses right now, but it's also tough for people to get a job. So they'll do anything to land that job. That's why you need to do skill-based hiring. What this means is you need each candidate to go through a skill test and actually provide samples of their work based on what they'll actually be doing if they get hired by your company. For video editors, is making a video based on your references. For designers, making a design based on your past work. For copywriters, writing a blog article based on your website. So you get my point. You want them to actually do samples of their work before you even interview them. Not only that, you need to actually test their knowledge on the complementary skills around their core skill. So for example, if you're hiring a video editor, do they understand video content creation? Do they understand copywriting? How's their level of English? Do they have good problem solving skills? Do they have good attention to detail? So you need to also test what their soft skills are and actually have it be measurable so you can compare between candidates. You can easily use Test Gorilla for this. This is what I use in my recruiting agency and my video editing agency. And point number three, AI powered remote workers are the future. I actually discussed this with my client, Frank Ponce, Mr. Beast's producer, and he agrees that AI is about to take over not only Hollywood, not only film production, but also the whole industry in business, in any industry that you can think of. And as AI gets more powerful, skills become a commodity. And when skills become a commodity, do you not think it's better to hire someone as skillful on the other side of the world instead of hiring someone in country? You can see AI already taking over industries like design with Midjourney, copywriting with Jenny.ai, video editing with Sora. AI is moving faster than ever before and it's just a matter of time before people with just meh skills will get replaced by expert remote talent. Because why? Because they only cost 30% compared to their US counterparts. It won't make sense anymore for companies to hire US college fresh graduates when you can hire a copywriter with five plus years of experience in a random village in Philippines that will do a better job, but still cost less than that US fresh graduate, especially if that remote worker is powered by AI. A combination of AI and remote workers will be the future of work. What used to be 10 people in office in the US to take care of 20 functions will be three remote workers in the Philippines to take care of all those 20 functions using AI. So you need to keep this in mind. Hiring in the US is about to change and you need to be ahead of the curve. Your competitors are doing this right now, so don't get left behind. That's why I created this video here, which is a full step-by-step -step guide on how to hire excellent remote workers. And the best part, it's 100% free on YouTube. No opt-ins, no paywalls, nothing. Just click the video on the screen and I'll see you there.